If you like to start your day with a cup of coffee like I do or drink it all day long like I do, then you'll want to see what Anthony Marino, the corporate chef of Don's Appliances, brought with him today. It's a pumpkin cappuccino, and of course, we're making a fall dish to go with it. Welcome, Chef Anthony. I already had to get into this. The sneak peek, yeah. My, my three hours of sleep from my uh, baby last night, it's not working for me. So I appreciate this, and it's delicious. In advance, yeah, this, guys, this is the Gen Air built-in coffee maker. We're showing the Gen Air version, but it's like a one touch cappuccino. That's so what great. it's really going to do right now is there's a milk reservoir on the right. It's just going to froth it. We're going to go right in. Right there. It's just going to froth us some nice. Wow. So nice. And I put pumpkin spice um, creamer in there mixed with half and half. So you got a little bit of both. That flavor. Yeah. And so, so what, it, what's in the, is it just coffee on the other side? And, and what it's going to do is grind you some espresso. So it's going to oh, shoot great. in some nice espresso. But this is what you get, guys, from the built-in coffee. It's going to grind each cup. It's going to tamper it down and it's going to really pack some nice espresso in there. That's how wow. you get these layers in your cappuccino. So this is a, you know, pro coffee shop worthy in your home. That's from amazing. Jenner. Like that little just just yeah. a little it, get that espresso in there just yeah. a little bit. Right there. Yeah, See, that's the dark. Up. That's the dark and good. Yeah. So that's like the finished guy right there. So let's put that wow. right there. So see how you get the nice Love layer. That. Look how beautiful that is. I know. That's, uh, I mean, that's pretty. I wouldn't drink it if I wasn't so tired, but I probably will <laughs> yeah. drink both have of these. Have a couple. <laughs> <laughs> that's is this a new product that you guys have? You know, this is one we've carried forever. I just, I've always wanted to bring it down in the sh and show everybody. So I finally, I said, guys, let's do it and let's bring it. So yeah. I have one of these every morning in the showroom. I'm guilty I'm as charged. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't blame you. It is delicious. And you said this one is sugar free. This is sugar free. So I use the sugar free, the uh, the the creamers, the you know, the pumpkin spice one, mm -hmm. and then just a little half and half. And then it does it. You don't even have to put anything in there. It's I'm enjoying it. It's delicious. Yeah. I've had a few this morning already as well. So <laughs> I'm just gonna put this guy on, ah. and start this up. So. So Along with we this, today? so yeah. we're gonna go. We're gonna make a butternut squash risotto in our Gen Air steam oven as well. That's the uh, machine on the top. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I have a Boreo rice right here. I have a little bit of corn. You can hang back. I got this. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna step back. No, 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 no. You don't want to give me an elbow to the face. Is that no, what you're saying? No, no, no. You need a little wiggle no, room. No, you okay. got a little coffee and talk about it. So what I'm gonna do? A little red onion in here. So okay. we're gonna start building the flavors. When we make risotto, traditionally it's like 45 minutes to an hour on the stove. Right. In the steam oven, we can make it in 26 minutes. Really? Because this oven will heat up with a convection fan, but it has a water reservoir on the side and it pumps in steam at 212 degrees. So now you could do hard boiled eggs in there, you could steam salmon, all your veggies, you don't wow. even have to use the cooktop, okay? That's so easy. Pretty nice, right? Yeah. A little butternut squash. Love some butternut squash. So guys, you're gonna have to cut this just a little bit thinner because we want it to cook in like the same aspect as the rice. So you don't want, like a big piece like this will take longer than the rice. Will, right. So. And this is, you haven't done anything to that butternut squash, right? Because I, I've tried to cook with butternut squash before and it's like extremely difficult to get into that thing. Yeah, so I, I actually did not do anything different to it. Okay. It's just, it's right. just raw squash. I just peeled it down just like that. Okay, so sounds good. A little bit of good stuff in there. So another call, heavy cream and chicken stock. I boil it together, mm -hmm. get that nice little flavor. It looks good. And we're going to put our liquid in here just like we would do with any of our rice. Two to one ratios, you know that. Is this pan, this pan, does this come with the steamer? Yeah. Because it looks get, like it goes right in there. Absolutely. The pan okay. goes with the steamer and it has a perforated pan as well. So it'll give you like a, um, a perforated pan just so you can actually steam through. It's pretty Great. sweet. We're going to cut some kielbasa. We're going to cut these. Risotto? Yeah, we're doing kielbasa and risotto today. I love it. I like, <laughs> and this is also kind of like a one pot meal, although mm -hmm. one pan meal, I guess you could call it. And that's the cool part about Gen Air. They're really going to say you can cook the whole meal in the steam oven. Okay, that's you can cool. steam your veggies, you can make your starches, potatoes work well. Yeah, sign like me that. up. Sign you up. <laughs> so check this out. I cheated ahead. I steamed it off. Here's the 26 minute. Here's our risotto. Wow. So check. Let me get rid of this cappuccino that I'll drink later. <laughs> I'll put this guy. Your fourth in. one of the day. Yeah, let me tell you what it happens. Doesn't make me. And then here's the kielbasa we steamed. So check that out. Wow. So here's the difference from that kielbasa to this guy. Look how plump it is. Nice and hot. Here's the finisher. Gotta add. A little bit of shave oh, parmesan. Yeah, right because here on why it. not? Why wouldn't you top it with cheese? And a little bit of fresh basil. That's so great. Check this guy out. Look at the rice right now. It is, it's perfect.
I've never made risotto, but I've watched a lot of cooking shows that say how difficult it is to get that right consistency, the perfect consistency. It is, and, and everybody, if you know risotto, everybody talks about the ribbons. Uh -huh. See that? That's oh, the ribbons yeah. we make. So that's like perfect risotto. That's so. great. I want to try it. You can get a the keeping spoonful. Of that. Okay, so while you're uh, serving this up for me, I want to talk a little bit about why you're wearing pink because we've been talking about this. And I was running to the studio earlier this morning, and you like threw one of these pink bracelets. You did. You at caught me. it in mid stride, <laughs> like a pro. You didn't even move. <laughs> so you're part of the real men wear pink. No, not wear. Is it wear? Yeah, real, real men, men wear, wear pink. pink. Yeah. Right. Okay. So all I'm month long, right. all of us guys, we wear pink. Right. I have, I have a huge, colorful wardrobe of pink now. So uh, it looks uh, we're, good on you. It does. I, I wear it well. I, you know, I'm trying. You know, um, but we're doing that um, cycle bar class tonight. Is one of our charity runs. Okay. So if there's bikes open, it's out in Robinson. It's going to be a blast. I'll have food and drinks after. And everybody, you know, wear your pink. I got pink socks. I got a pink cycle bar T-shirt. It's uh, everything fun. Isn't really that good. It? It's delicious. And I know you guys are doing a really good job with this campaign. Yep. Ron's been raising some money, doing tons of events all month long to try and get people to donate and and get involved. So mm -hmm. great yeah. stuff. All right, thanks. You're a busy guy. That's it. That is for sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jeff Anthony, corporate chef for Don's Appliances. We thank you as always. Delicious food. And we also want to thank uh, Don and Lux for providing our kitchen set here on PTL. Love checking out this new steamer. Uh, Good yeah, stuff. Here, yes. Up next